A few days ago, we got word that in Totally Accurate Battle Simulator, there were beings from other planets here. And so, from the depths was brought forth a void, brought forth to challenge these multi-purse beings, and we quickly found out just how terrifying things were. So the medieval faction got word that the void has been released because their scholars have been studying this mythical beast for many, many, dude, there's always one. Every time I try to do an intro, there's always something with goofy eyes or weird heads or something that ruins it. Anyway, their scholars have been studying the void for many years. And so they thought they must come witness this thing firsthand. Only when they arrived on the scene, they've discovered that everything is back to normal. The Void is gone and the multiverse beings have been vanquished and the Void has been silenced back to the Earth. However, when the Void was released, a mythical beast, unlike anything the world has ever seen before, was released from its cage. It was bound for a thousand years and has been released and it is risen. The Dark Peasant lives and this is not just any Dark Peasant. Oh no, this is Dark Peasant 2.0, capable of doing the things... <laughs> Come on, dude! Capable of doing many wondrous things, as you can see. But wait until you see the power that the Dark Peasant has! <gasps> he has exactly... Did they listen to my mod idea or what? The Dark Peasant has risen. He is Dark Peasant 1.0 mixed with 2.0. And he brings forth spears from the ground, just like the original Dark Peasant. Everything I have been wanting has come true. And here it is. Oh, he takes out everything in one hit. Oh my goodness. It's wonderful. It's amazing. It is the dark He's so derpy looking. <laughs> I love it, man. It's what we're doing today. Let's do it. All right, so this unit was made by Fern. Uh, if you recall the exotic faction, we've got all these guys, the poison speech. Whoa, this is a new thing, dude. Oh, these guys are new. Heavy spear? Are these dudes new? These dudes are new, man. That's a zombie. The duelist. That spear guy's new. Wait a minute, man. Everything else is the same. Hold on. Somebody told me there were secret things in the secret area. Not this one, apparently. Uh, these are all broken units. Yo, this guy's got a spear, man. This guy's cool looking. Look at that glowing spear. I like it. So there's those. Uh, things and then the possessed bodies. I like these guys. These guys are cool, man. I like those spears Guys, this is exact. I don't know did Fern. Did you hear me man? Did you watch my video and make it happen? Did you bring it to life my man? If so, maybe it was his own idea. I don't know, but whatever the case I'm I'm just amazed and so glad that it's in the game so time wizard with the exotic faction and the dark peasant <gasps> Can the Time Wizard stop the Dark Peasant or does not matter? So if you don't know, the Time Wizard can stop time, but he doesn't stop projectiles. Oh, too late, too late Time Wizard. You got yourself a nice spike. Dude, look at this, it's exactly like the original. Although not, no, 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 no. Not exactly like the original. There's about 20 spears per unit with the original one. Do you remember that? I mean, it was just so amazing. It was like my favorite, yeah, some of my favorite units. I think DT, DT might be my favorite one. I know some people probably not like the M16 guy, but I liked it. I thought it was great. Oh, we got a guy left alive over here. Don't know how to happen. Look at this guy. He's like a chicken with his head cut off. He's like twitching over here. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Guys, this is amazing. The dark peasant lives. So great. Actually, this one's got like a couple. He's got like four coming out. They just don't go all. They don't go. They don't go all over. Oh, I have an idea. Okay, I want to see how fast he does it. He does it extremely fast. Just as fast as. I mean, it's pretty darn quick, man. Look at those spikes. They're glorious. Um, 
the okay this guy definitely he looks the coolest the uh, uh the heavy spear guy he looks really cool i think he's one of the coolest looking ones so far just because he's got the spears you know? i wish he had him still this guy's you see that guy twitching over here I'm trying to get a cool shot from above look at that dude man dark peasant returns I, you know it's kind of like 2.0 because he flies how do you get him to fly by the way he flies but um you know hey whatever okay here's my here is my real question what happens against the witch so if you don't know the witch shoots out little babies oh in the air look at that in the air look at these guys down here how'd that he just happened like so fast look at that look at that stuff man Great, straight up in the air that's all he needs it's over gg look at his range holy moly its range is like pretty far what about a uh i want to test everything what about a valkyrie where am i at what am i doing what am i doing <laughs> guys i swear i played this game every day i play it every day i swear can you stop all those i bet he can oh my goodness is there anything he can't stop is there anything i don't know i don't know if it's possible he's pretty op man all right we got to think of something what about okay long ships i want to see what happens here with these I want to see what happens with the dragon. Oh, that's going to be nice. We need to think of something crazy. Monkey King. But only that'll only work if it hits him. Uh, what? What? Scarecrows. Scarecrow. With the birds? Will he hit the birds? What about the snake archers? Will he hit the snakes? All right, let's see what happens. This is going to be crazy. He's going to hit the boat. And then when the guys fall off, he'll probably... Oh, whoa! He doesn't hit the snake. He's dodging him, though. Look at him, look at him, look at him. Oh, yeah, but the, the birds can't get him. Look at the people on the boats are freaking out, dude! Oh, he did get all the... Did he get it? No. He was hitting the birds there at the end. Or is it the snakes? Oh, it's the snakes. I think. No, he impaled the bird right here. Look at that. <laughs> he got that bird, man. <laughs> so the boat's kind of freaked out. Like this guy on the top up here just spinning around. Are there any other units that would be interesting to try? What can get him? Let's see. I want to just try a bunch of spear throwers. Can any anybody get him? How much HP does that? I've heard get like 50 million HP. They can't even throw any time. They're hitting him. Hitting them. Look at all that. Look at all that, dude. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, they're throwing. Woo! Get the spear, dude. Ow. Look at all this. Do we, we ever? They got him. They took him out. No. The dark presence should be able to withstand that. Come on, man. Don't do me like that. Don't do the dark peasant like that. He's got more HP than you can even imagine. Oh man, that's gonna that's gonna get him. Look at him. When he when we first started the video, he was hitting a tree on Derpy like. Oh yeah, he's 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 not good against projectiles. The projectiles they get him every time. Very nice, very nice. Okay. Somebody is like, I love it when Entech talks like him. He brings out his Mexican accent, but I've never done that before. Oh my gosh. Look at all those arrows in this dude. Yep. Dark peasant, you don't do well against range units, but against everything else. What about something like a, oh, let's test this guys. I've got ideas. I've got ideas. Can he do, how, how many spikes does it take to take this dude out? Oh yes. Oh, oh my gosh. What in the heck? What in the heck just happened, dude? <laughs> we broke it. We broke him. Look at him, dude. <laughs> He's all squished in there. We broke it, man. What is this thing? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. The dark peasant has risen. He needs a Bane voice. Oh, the dark peasant has... The... I used to be able to do this voice so well. Bane. Oh, I see you like the dark peasant. He rises from the ashes. 
I can't do it. I used to be able to do it so well. So well. I can't do it anymore. I want to watch that movie again. Just for Bane. Just for Bane, because Bane's amazing. Yeah, look at the giants all derp out, dude. Look at this guy. <laughs> what up, brother? You got you got squished. Oh, oh! Look at this guy's neck. Oh. Get, get squished in there, dude. Hey, yeah, do you like that? This is enjoyable. I don't know why is this so entertaining to me. Hope you guys are enjoying this. All right, let's do the giant samurai. I need to find a different map to play on. I just play on this map all the time, and I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, dude. Oh. <laughs> okay, if you made it to this part of the video, go ahead and comment uh, uh, to the owies. Right to the owies, <laughs> if you know what I'm saying. Oh, and this guy right through the head. Oh, my goodness. Wow, that's some brutal stuff right there. The giants are pretty fun. What about like a wheelbarrow? What happens there? Oh! Almost got him. Oh, they're still going. Wow. The wheelbarrow is kind of kind of derpy. Dude, this is like the coolest looking dude so far. He's like, I'm just laying up here. Bob Ross is my name. Happy trees. Happy trees. Happy dragons, happy dark peasant. <laughs> Good job, dark peasant. You top Bob Ross, who's boss over here? Oh, here we go. Cheerleaded tornado guy. What happens here? Oh, oh, he got stepped. Oh, look at his leg is broken in there. It's not even. It's not even. It's bad enough, dude. He doesn't just. He doesn't just go for the kill. He like. He like makes him suffer. Like the true dark peasant would. I mean, is there is has there ever been a unit in the game more fearsome than the dark peasant? I think not. And 1.0 too, not 2.0. 2.0 just flew around like a dummy. He's like, I got new powers. I'm just gonna fly around and suck people up. No. 1.0 is like, I'm going into the battle, and I'm gonna bring forth my sticks of doom. And impale everybody. I mean, he's a he's a monster. He's a legit monster. Oh, he's turning green. He only got a couple of them. The the Eulers are the Eulers are good, man. Is that a tad thing? All right. I don't think there's anything else. Decky. Oh, what about Berserker? What happens with Berserkers? Let's see. I just want to test things that are different. You know. Get your jump off. Uh -oh. oh, there they go. Look at that. Look at that weirdness. Oh, everything's breaking. The game is breaking. Oh. Oh. The spears of destiny over here. Oh, yes. So they got him in the air. He gets him in the air. What's that one for? Is there anything else that flies or something? Anything else even remotely? What about ma Let's see mammoths. Watch out. A whole herd of mammoths gets speared. Oh, <laughs> there they go. So this is the difference between, you know, like a modded unit and a unit in a game. A modded unit, you know, it can bring it forth and bring it up, but it can't, like, stick it through them, you know? Like, only on the kill, I think. So if they don't die right away, they just get pushed up into the air. That's a pretty cool shot, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The dark peasant just hovering over here. He's so dark, you can't even see him. That's pretty cool, though. I don't know, man. I really hope Landfall remakes the Dark Peasant, but it kind of seemed like they're not going to. What do you guys think? I'd love to hear your thought on the new Dark Peasant. The guy is a monster, in my opinion. Devastating. Can defeat whole armies with, with ease. You look at him just jittery. I'm just ready to go. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm re no, Dark Peasant doesn't talk, okay? He doesn't say a word. He's ominous and dark, mystical, mythical, legendary beast. Wait, can you be a legend and a myth, mythical, at the same time? I don't think you can, can you? The legendary mythical beast? No, no, no. That seems like an oxymoron. Seems like an oxymoron, does it not? <laughs> and Terry's talking about morons over here, and he says moron. <laughs> I gotta go, guys.